Yan. Uh, last example for this one. Uh, refer to table 1.3 to determine the average distance between the Earth and the Sun. So, let's go back to our book. Balik tayo sa libro natin. Uh, tignan daw natin yung table 1.3. Saan yung table 1.3? Table 1.3. Nasaan na yung libro ko? Uh, okay. okay. Table 1.3. Nandito yung mga, ano, mga distances. Ano? Table 1.3 is uh, the length in meters. Approximate values of length, mass, and time. So, kung titingnan yung table 1.3, open your book. Ano hindi ko na may papakita sa PowerPoint. Sa PDF na sa page ano siya, page 20. Okay, so kung titingnan niyo yung distance between the Earth and the Sun. Distance from Earth to Sun. Nasaan siya? Distance. From the Earth to the Sun is 10 raised to 11. Okay, 10 raised to 11. Distance from Earth to Sun is equal to 10 raised to 11 meters. Okay, sa so, nanjan yan sa table 1.3. Okay, so Calculate the average speed of the Earth in its orbit in kilometers per second. Assuming, di ba, this is the average distance from the Earth to the Sun. For, uh, kung idrodrawing natin ito, kung nandyan yung orbit ng Earth, nandito yung Sun. So, basically, the distance is the radius, tama? Yung distance from Earth to Sun is the radius of this circle. Assuming na circle yung orbit. Okay, so yan yung 10 raised to 11 natin. This is the radius. Okay? So, ang tinatanong dito, the speed of the Earth in its orbit. Alam natin that the Earth is uh, revolving around the Sun. Tapos nakocomplete niya yung one revolution in 365 and one fourth days. Tama? So... 365 and one one revolution is 365 and one fourth, so that's 0.25 days. Okay, so ang ano natin is speed is distance over time, tama? Distance over time. So the speed is equal to distance. Over the time. In this case, the distance is the circumference of the circle, tama? Sempre the total distance traveled is the circumference of the circle, and we know that the circumference of a circle has a formula na two pi r. So this is two pi times ten raised to eleven meters. Two pi r. All over the time, the time is three hundred sixty-five point twenty-five. Days. Yan. So, meron tayong makukuha dyan in meters per days. E ang tinatanong dito, uh, kilometers per second. Kilometers per second. So, kailangan natin itong i-convert from uh, kilometers second. Uh, kilometers muna. Nasa taas yung meter. So, ibig sabihin, nasa taas dapat yung kilometer nasa baba yung 1,000 meters. Okay? Tapos, days to seconds. Lagay ko na lang dito, ano? Times days to second. Alam natin that one day is 24 hours. Tapos, uh, hours naman to seconds. Alam natin kanina that one hour 
is 3,600 seconds. So, cancel na yung meters, meters, days, tsaka day, hours to hours. So, ang natira dito is uh, So, sa taas, sa numerator, we have 2 pi times 10 raised to 11. Tapos, wala na. Times 1 times 1 times 1 na lahat. So, sa denominator na lahat yan, 365.25 times 1,000 times 24 times 3,600. So, ang sagot natin dito is 19... 0.9102 kilometers per second. Ang bilis pala ng Earth. No? Imagine, yan yung speed natin revolving around the sun. 19 kilometers per second. 20 kilometers per second. <laughs>